So X-ray fluorescence measures the metals that are present at or near the surface of a given object. So he, we're going to show you that today. So I have a penny. There's my penny from 2005. And the other side of it, I've sanded down so that you see the inner core of the penny. Pennies made in 1982 and onward, more recently, have this inner core. And we'll see what that's made of. And then it's coated with uh, copper. All right, so first we'll put the copper side of the penny down on the, on the uh, window. I am in alloy mode here, so it's going to an analyze for metals. I'm going to click Start. OK, so the test has completed. And uh, the data are displayed here in terms of percent of each metal. So we have 52% copper, 47% zinc, and 0.08% nickel. I'm going to zoom back out and also show that, yes, there is a spectrum associated with this. So that was the copper side of the penny. Now I'm going to run uh, the silvery side and put that side down. We'll see what this is made of. All right, the test has completed. Uh, we've got 98.99% zinc. We've got 0.86% copper, 0.075% vanadium, 0.06% iron. There's a little bit of titanium and a little bit of nickel.